All right. As you can tell, my hair is pretty long right now. Uh, my last haircut was in January of 2020, um, right before the whole pandemic. Um, I haven't cut my hair since. It's really long, longest I've ever had it at least. Um, I was planning on donating it, uh, but even at the current length, it's still probably only around six inches across. There's no way to braid anything in the back um, that I know of and haven't been able to get anybody to, to figure that out for me. But um, So I'm not going to be donating and I'm going to be cutting it. Um, I'll be starting a new job here pretty soon. Um, so I need to have pretty good first impressions. I think I was able to hide it pretty well on the, uh, the job interviews and all that good stuff. But pretty excited about um, new opportunity. But hair gots to finally go. Let me know what you think about my haircut in the comments below. Also hit that like button if you like the new style. Now to some before and after shots. So the picture on the left is me at a, a headshot at work and that was basically the moment I decided to get my hair cut. Um, if you check out some of these videos, you can see on the one on the right, I've got super long hair. It's a little blonde on the back. I've got my hair cut, everything off, about a three on the side, um, scissored up top. I think it looks pretty good right now. Pretty, pretty happy overall with the haircut. I think it's going to look pretty professional when I get on there and uh, Monday to start the new job. Um, so here's the back view. You can see all that hair was cut off the back. Here's a side view right up to the ears, cut up, um, looks much better. And there's me with my signature uh, thumbs up. So pretty happy with it overall. Um, honestly, really like the haircut, super happy with it. Um, you know, you got to have good first impressions to start a new job. Wasn't a requirement. It's just I've never started a hair with or never started a job with long hair um, and uh, definitely want to have a good first impression. Um, it was fun growing the hair out. It kind of started as a never had long hair before. Let's just do it. Um, we, we, we all went home for the pandemic and we never came back. And so um, it was just a good opportunity to have have long hair. I experienced it, got the ponytail, got the, the long, um, long blonde hair on the tips, not, not because I dyed it, just because of being out in the sun. Uh, and it was, it was a good experience, but I'm glad to not have hair on my neck anymore. That was the most irritating piece of it. A little sad that I didn't get to donate it. I really wanted to donate my hair, but it was going to take me a whole, probably a whole another year, um, at a minimum to get that 12, 10 to 12 inches. And uh, it just, I needed, I needed, a, I needed a change. And uh, honestly, starting this new job, I really wanted to make a good first impression. So um, I know this isn't a finance video, but I just wanted to share a little bit about what happened and where my hair all went. Um, so it didn't shock anybody, um, hopefully too much. Um, but this is normally how um, how I look. Uh, this is normally how I keep my hair um, styled. You just caught me when I started making my videos during a time in my life where I had the opportunity to have long hair and that's um, that's what I decided to do. So um, hopefully you enjoy this video. It has nothing to do with finance. It's, I mean, I saved some money on haircuts, obviously, uh, but I mean, uh, it, you're not gonna, you're not gonna be, if you invest the money you're making on, you're, you're saving on haircuts, um, depending on how much you spend on a haircut, I guess you could save a little bit of money and, and make money on those, but point is, is that not gonna, it's not gonna make you a millionaire just not getting haircuts. I know this video isn't finance related, so I hope you didn't mind me posting it. Just wanted to share with y'all, uh, my subscribers. Hope you have a good rest of your day. Talk to you later. Frank Finance, out.